This food bank sees a steady line of people hit by hard times, but Valerie Treore is always fighting to improve their situation. When people get laid off and when unemployment rises, we feel that in the food banking industry because this is where they're coming to put food on their tables. Valerie runs the Food Bank of South Jersey, which feeds more than 100,000 people in Camden, New Jersey. And of that number, 36,000 of them are children, and then about 10,000 of them are seniors that are making the difficult decision between whether they're gonna pay for food or pay for medicine. I know you all are really working with a limited budget, so having a food resource like this. We don't have a budget at all. We have no budget. We have no budget. 54% of the people that are living in Camden City are below, uh, at the poverty level, living below. But this 25-year-old food bank is making life for those residents a little easier. The Food Bank of Southern Jersey has been a blessing to our family church, for the members of the church, and for the community around us. It just takes the loss of a job or a serious disability to take someone from middle income spiral right down to low income, spiral down again into poverty. To help keep people from starving, Valerie is depending on volunteers and financial support. With this economy being the way that it is, we have seen our donations drop significantly. So we've reached out to the corporate community to help us, and Campbell Soup, God bless them, because they've been a partner of the food bank for many years. Val is an unbelievable champion. I mean, she's a great spokesperson for the, for the food bank. She's a great spokesman, spokesperson for, for hunger relief. She's one of the key partners that we have in the community, so we couldn't be more pleased with the work that we do with, with Val and the food bank. I want to thank you on behalf of all of those people that will eat this Thanksgiving because of the work that you're doing today. God bless you for what you've done, for what you're doing, and for what I hope that you will continue to do. We, we love you all so much. Thank you. And despite the challenges of a tough economy, Valerie says her drive to help people will never change. When we open our doors every day, we're, we're thinking about three primary things. One is that we want to have enough food to feed people that are coming to us for food. Number two is that we want to teach them how to eat nutritiously. And then the third thing that we think about all the time is what can we do to help people find sustainable ways to improve their lives? <laughs>